Hi, my name's Claire and I'm one of the Senior Employment Lawyers at Vista. One question that we frequently get asked by clients um, who are managing uh, ill health situations is whether they have to offer an alternative role to a disabled person or whether they can require them to go through a competitive uh, job interview process. So I'm just going to give you a quick overview of some of the things that you might like to consider if you face such a situation. If you do want any more information, then if you have a look on our website, there's a blog um, which also deals with the same issue. So first and foremost, um, if you have a disabled person and they are unable to do their role anymore, but there's a vacant role which they potentially could do, then it could be a reasonable adjustment to appoint them into that role, even if it's a higher grade role and even if they're not the best candidate for the job. Um, and we know that because there's a well-established Court of Appeal principle in the case of Archibald and Fife that lays down that principle. However, just because there is a role available doesn't mean that they should automatically be put into that role. So, for example, if a specific qualification was required for the role, and they don't have that qualification and it couldn't be obtained with minimal training, then obviously it wouldn't be reasonable to redeploy them into the role. However, if they could do the role with some training, then it would be reasonable to provide that training and to redeploy them. And that's even the case if the disabled person would be treated more favourably than people, for example, at risk of redundancy. One thing to also bear in mind is if the alternative uh, role is at a lower grade or attracts a lower rate of pay, then it isn't necessarily a reasonable adjustment to maintain their previous rate of pay and the role should be offered um, on the uh, salary and benefits package commensurate with that role. As I say, these are just some of the considerations that you may wish to take into account. If you want to find uh, any more information, as I say, please have a look at the website or alternatively, uh, please contact a member of the VISTA team.